Hey guys, it's Paul. I'm going to give you a really quick introduction to accepting um, PayPal payments for people signing up for your Zoom uh, webinar. Uh, if you come to this page, I'll put a link. Uh, this is how to do it. We're going to go to settings, registration, connect PayPal. Then we're going to go through and add uh, PayPal to the webinar, right? So Log into your account, go to my account, go to uh, account management, webinar settings, come all the way down to where it says registration settings, and then when it says allow option to charge registration fee, click edit, allow option, PayPal require PayPal, connect to your PayPal. So my business PayPal is, uh, Paul at paulnicholson.com. I'm in Ukania, United Kingdom, and collect, right? It's going to ask for my password. Hopefully, it can remember it. I haven't used it for a while. Uh, allow Zoom, take payments, obviously, read everything, automatically deduct their fee. How, da, da, da. Right, so they're going to take a percentage, I guess. I'm not sure how much it is. You'll successfully authorize Zoom video communications. Go back to Zoom communications. And this part is switched on, right? Allow options uh, to charge. We're going to save. It's connected to my business account. Right, so now I'm going to go webinars. I'm going to... Um, uh, I can edit an already created webinar. So if, you go, if you've already got webinars created, you can go through uh, where you see um, approval down here. You can go edit and you can here change registration and say how much it is and what figure, right? So you can say whatever it is. It's $5 to enter, uh, anything like that, right? So that's if you've already got a um, webinar set up. What we'll do, let's do one from scratch, right? So we're going to start a webinar, schedule a webinar, testing PayPal, All right? We're going to be, if you've got a template, do a template, time doesn't matter. Registration required. It's not going to show up there, right? It's not going to show up and save it there. Do all your other settings and schedule, right? So don't worry that it doesn't show it. Now you're going to go down here the second time. Um, and go to approval, approval, automatically approve, edit, charge registration. So let's charge uh, webinar support up to 100 registrants. If you want to enlarge it, obviously you can um, uh, upgrade your account. Um, let's say it's a dollar. I don't know if we do it any less, it might. Or should I just do no? Uh, the fee must be greater than. Let's do 50 cents because I'm just going to do a test, right? 0 0.5, save all. So now when people come to your registration page, there should be a pay button, right? Here we go. Registration fee is 50p, 50 euro, 50, Jesus, 50 US dollar. Pay and register. You will be charged 50. Continue. Uh, my, let's do this one so I don't have to do it with my accounting. Oh, what's happened? It's my Chrome more than uh, the actual PayPal thing, I think. Oh. Pay and register, continue to PayPal, uh, Paul Home. You have, a, you have a business PayPal account where you're, um, uh, you're, having, you're always buying stuff on PayPal and then you have to cross reference it. And so you end up with, about, I've got three PayPals now just to keep my accountant happy. So there we go. Testing PayPal, registration fee, you are in. Um, and that is how to integrate your PayPal. I guess I'm going to get some emails coming through with PayPal emails saying you've paid. You can refund somebody via your PayPal. If you go into your PayPal, you can send the money back just by refunding receipt for your PayPal. Here we go. Uh, payment status completed. 50 pence. Cost you 42p. Uh, here's your info. So that is your receipt. Uh, here's your email that you've signed up and you paid. Here's the links to sign up and log into your webinar. Uh, and if I go into the Zoom accounting, if you're running the webinar, 
When you refresh the page, you will have registrations at the bottom to view. Here we go, test poll. Does it show the money, does it? I guess the money, the money side, you'll have to track through your PayPal uh, and play it that way. But hopefully that was a quick how to uh, charge for your webinars in Zoom. Uh, get a little bit of money um, for people signing up, right? Any questions, uh, come and leave a comment. I'll create videos. Come to uh, pnuk.co, Zoom training. All my lessons on Zoom are in uh, Zoom training. I'm going to keep adding them. There's all the official Zoom uh, videos as well. And there's a forum where you can ask me anything and I will help you out with your Zoom stuff. Um, and finally, if, if this video has helped, to subscribe to, to my channel would be amazing. Uh, see you all soon. Cheers.